Hey, hey everybody and welcome back to today's video. So today we are going to be doing our cash and blow up stuffing for the second week of October. And we are using my Erin Condren Month of the Deluxe Planner. I am filming in the middle of the day so all the kids are running through the house. If you hear them, I am very sorry. My husband is trying to keep them quiet, but that doesn't always work. So, but let's go ahead and flip on over to October. And we are going to first do our paycheck breakdown so we can see how much money came in this week and how much we're putting in each of our envelopes. Hold on one second. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. We're gonna use purple today. Some green and orange and purple for our Halloween themed. So we are gonna zoom in so we can see a little bit better. All right, so this week, James's check was $7.65 and 61 cent. And then I brought in nothing yet. Usually I bring in something about the third or fourth paycheck if I bring anything in. But we did sell something for $20. So we have that. So our total is $7.85.61. Alright. So we're just going to go straight down. And most of these numbers are going to be the same as um, last week's. Except for down here at the bottom. They will be a little bit different. So for groceries, 130. For the Mazda and the rent, it's 120 each. For power, it is 40. And this month I'm doing exact amounts that way I don't have to kind of fluctuate as much. But hopefully back next month I will be able to, to round it up a little bit. So but Allstate is 39. For AT&T, 37. For gas, is 30. Water is 16. Charter will be 14. Student loans, 12. Pest control, 7. Spending will get 20. Miscellaneous is going to get 10. The cushion is getting 30. And then for savings this week, we are doing 20. And sinking funds and debt are each getting 70. All right. And that equals 785. All right. So there is our paycheck breakdown for this week. So we're going to set this to the side. We're going to pull out our cash, get it set up. So we have quite a few questions in the comments. I'm just going to address most of them that I remember here. One of the questions was, do I have like Netflix or Hulu? I personally do not. I, I have some family members that have different accounts and we all just kind of share them. Um, that way we kind of get the money's worth out of it. And then um, for... We're gonna slide those up. Alright, so we need to zoom out just a bit. Um, another question was um, another question was on our anniversary sinking fund. Was that including for a babysitter? Um, me and my sisters, we have all have kids and we kind of switch off babysitting each other's kids and we don't charge each other. We just kind of switch off each one of us having each other's kids when we need we need somebody and that's just my family and that's how we handle it also somebody asked about clothing sinking funds and how my how we get away with clothing we have 10 years worth of clothes like we don't have any old bigger size clothes but all the little kids all have clothes that are in really good condition because most of them didn't wear a lot of the clothes because there were so many given to us and we bought from before I really started budgeting and things so we have all the boys clothes in the world that we ever want or need and then for Alexis she gets a lot of clothes for birthday and Christmas and then my her grandmother she's the only girl so she's kind of gets spoiled with a bunch of clothes from her so that's why we don't really have a clothing fund right now and if my husband doesn't really usually need anything um and then if he needs like socks or undershirts or whatever, 
we will go and use miscellaneous if we need to for him but we had clothing and it wasn't getting used and i took it away so but it will come back but that's just not right now but it will so another question let's answer one more question and then we're going to start stuffing and i just set on my someone asked about the ads on youtube i literally just click a button that says i want to monetize the video and that is all i do i don't add the video i don't add any ads it's just i think it depends on the length of the video and how many ads they put in i don't sure of their algorithm whatever that word is for adding ads to videos but i haven't been adding ads to my videos personally i just hit a button that says yes monetize it and then youtube does the whole adding a adding the ads that's a tongue twister for a minute adding the ads to my videos so that is not me it is youtube that has done that so let's go ahead and get started though that was a long a lot of talking all right so first we need to switch two of these envelopes really fast so i try to keep them in order as the largest amount to the smaller amount and our phone bill is larger than our gas bill now or gas amount so we're going to switch those two all right groceries one 20 and 30. so this is our second week so we should have double of everything for the first part of this so we have one two 20 40 50 60. so 260 fabulous for the mazda we are adding 120 so one and 20. all right and this one also had extra from last week because of um we added uh, about 80 I think it was extra 80 into Mazda. So we have 1, 2, 20, 40, 60, 80, 3, 20. So we have 320 going towards our car, which I believe we'll, we'll pay it this coming week. Let me check. Yeah, because it's uh, today's the 10th. Yeah, so I will pay it this upcoming week. And that will move our car payment not due until January, which is fabulous. I am so excited. I'm getting it ahead. All right, next up is rent. Rent gets 120. All right, so now we have one, two, 20, 40. So 240 for there. All right, power, we do 40. So 20 and 40. So 20, 40, 60, 80. All right. For all state, it is 39. So 20, 35, 6, 7, 8, and 9. I think the twins are back up and running amok. All right. So for all state, we now have 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78. 78. Fabulous. All state is done. AT&T, 37. So 20, 35, 6, 7. So 20, 35, 6, 7. So for the phone bill, we now have 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74. So 74 for the phone. For gas, it's 30. So 20 and 30. So now we have 20, 40, 50, and 60. For water, we have 16, 10, 15, and 16. All right, so now we have 10, 20, 25, 30, they're 132 for the water. Next up, we have charter and we're adding 14. So 10, 11, 12, 13, and 14 here. So 10, 11, 12, 13, 
So we have 10, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. So 28 for our charter bill. Student loans gets 12, 10, 11, 12. All right, and we have 20, 30, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44. Fabulous. All right, next up is pest control, and pest control gets seven. So five, six, seven. So now we have five, 10, 11, 12, 13, and 14 for pest control. And we have personal spending for me and James, which is 20. That gives us 40. Miscellaneous, we are adding 10, which now gives us 20. Okay. For savings, we are adding a 20. And now we have 20, 40, 60, 61, 62 in our savings. So there's that one. And these are just empty ones. And this here is where I put the money that is left over from the one bill that hasn't been paid, which is our car tax or car insurance. And it's still not due for another two weeks. So that will go or roughly week and a half, about a week and a half. So that don't need to go in there until closer to that time. So we don't think we have it to spend, but that is where I put the extra, which is usually only about one bill and it's the car insurance. So, all right, so those are all of our bills and expenses, normal amounts. Next up is debt and we're doing 70. So 20, 40, 60, and 70. So $70 for our debt payment extra. So 60 is going to the car. That gives us now one, two, 20, 40, 60, 80, 3, 20, 40, 60, 80. So that gives us 380, almost a whole car payment right there. So that will go and pay in mid next week. I will pay that for half. And then we're adding 10 to student loans. Also, if y'all are interested in any cash envelopes, I am creating some. I am about to create a set with pretty brighter colors. So if you're interested in those, I let me know in the comments and I will get a couple different um, sets together for these. So let me know in the comments if y'all like lighter colors or not, and I will get them ready if y'all do. So for student loans, we now have 20, 30, 40, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54. 54 and our normal payment is 57 I believe let's see yeah 57 <clears throat> so we pretty much already have our student loan normal amount so anything left a few dollars is left to make it a full regular amount and we still have three weeks to add money to it which is really exciting so those are all of our cash envelopes for our bills and expenses we are going to move over to our sinking funds right here all right so i said last week that we are not stuffing any more in anniversary right now and holiday all right and we actually already got all of the kids holiday halloween costumes and stuff so what's if we need anything like a bag of candy or something got something gets lost and we need to pick up something for their costumes or whatever we'll have that money there because there's a hundred in there so that's good so we have seventy dollars to add to our lovely what is it six one two three four five six six categories all right so we are going to do 15 in birthdays and 15 in christmas and then 10 and the rest. So 10, 10, 10, and 10. Okay. So there's that. <clears throat> so anniversary is fully funded, ready to go. We have enough money for me and him to either go out for dinner, for lunch, something, so we can celebrate our anniversary. 
birthdays is 15 so 10 15 um and i want to have at least 200 maybe 250 in this before james before about 100 for my birthday and about 100 for him for his for him on his birthday so so we have 20 40 60 70 75 80 85 86 so we are close to 100 on that for before my birthday so that's really good car maintenance we had to use car maintenance just the other day james had to get some filters for his car so we're going to add a 10 we're going to do two fives to this one so now we have 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64 for that. Oh, nope, there's a 10. I missed one. Hold on. So we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74. So we have $74 in car maintenance. That's fabulous. Christmas will be 15, so 10 and 15. All right. So now we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 71, 72. $572 for Christmas. Love it. I am so excited for Christmas. We This is the most prepared I feel like we've ever been. Dance, we don't need anything to stuff yet. Gifts is getting 10, so 5 and 10. All right, so now we have 20, 30, 35, and 40 for gifts, which is fabulous. We have a birthday party this weekend, and I believe that's it. And then I can just start stuffing it for when we have a pop-up party or something that we're invited to. Nothing for holiday because we have a hundred. Medical is getting a 10. All right. So we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70. So 70 for medical. And someone asked about copays for ERs. We've never had a copay for the ER. So I've never seen it on his insurance stuff like when we go like we hardly ever go to the doctor or er we do our one year physical checkup like we're supposed to but we tr if we feel like we're sick we prefer to try to get into the doctor's office versus the er because they're the bill when we get sent home is crazy so we don't really try to go there too often and when we do there's never been a copay so i'm not sure if he even has one because usually the only time we go is when a kid gets hurt i can't remember the last time i or james has actually been to the er so i don't know about that but i will look it up because his insurance stuff is about to be due again in october so it's that time of the year all right school we are adding 15 or 10 not 15 10 so for school we now have 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. So 50 bucks in school, which is fabulous. I'm loving it. Um, and school is about to go back full time. I'm so excited for it because she is not benefiting from learning at home. And I'm just grateful school is going back full time. And this here is utilities. I want to explain this. So I budget a certain amount on my power and water and I try to go over what they should be and whatever is left over I put in here and add let it add up a little bit that way if the bill is more than what I actually budgeted I can pull it from here and not from like savings or the cushion or anything like that sorry if you can hear the screaming that was the twin all right but that is all of our sinking funds and this card here is literally just to help me know how much I've added each week. So when I fill in my budget, it's easier to count it up. So that's what that is used for. So we have all of our sinking funds stuffed. I have all of my bills and expenses stuffed. I've answered a lot of y'all's questions answered. 
And for me personally, having it in cash and seeing it, it's a lot easier than having it in the account. I am definitely more of a cash person than a bank or card person. That said, make sure y'all do check out my Etsy shop. It's down below. Um, let me know if y'all like these colored, brighter colors for envelopes. And if you do, I will get some created and put in the shop. That way y'all have some more selections. Um, but I hope that y'all stay tuned for my next em cash envelope stuffing video next week. And I can't wait to see y'all then. Bye-bye <laughs> now.